Hello everybody, I'm Mag 1997 I'm going to give you some news. Ooh, it's too low, probably. There we go. Mag 1997 here. Um, I'm going to tell you about some astronomy news. Um, about eclipses, solar and lunar eclipses. Today is July 22nd, 2009. And a total solar eclipse occurred in Asia today. Um, it lasted. It was the longest solar eclipse in this century so far. It lasted almost seven minutes. Um, basically, what happened? The moon went between the Earth and the sun, and the and it went. Com it blocked out the sun completely. I mean, you it. Daytime turned into blackness for that almost seven minutes. Now, in this book, this is an astronomy book. It'll predict lunar and solar eclipses. They didn't predict the eclipse today in this book. It's not in this book, so they must have just now figured that out. But then, in this book, it says for... Um, uh, let's turn here. Planet position. Okay, here we go. Um, and July 11, 2010, they a another total a total lunar uh, total solar eclipse will occur in the Pacific Ocean. This uh, eclipse will last five minutes and 18 seconds. So, and more news on January 29th this year, 2009. There was a annular solar eclipse. This occurred in the South Atlantic and Indian Oceans. Lasted 7 minutes 56 seconds. So that's solar eclipses. Lunar eclipses. February 20th, 2008 was our last total eclipse that occurred. Lasted 3 hours and 24 minutes. And, la and uh, the... Duration of where it turns red was just about an hour, about 50 minutes actually. Okay, and our last lunar eclipse that occurred was July 7, 2009. It was a partial. Um, I didn't know about it till now, so I never watched it, how far it went. And then we'll have two more lunar eclipses this year so far that I know of. The next one will be August 6th, 2009. That will be a partial eclipse. Um, it'll be almost like a total one. The moon will complete. Sorry, my cat's scratching on the door. Um, the moon will almost completely disappear and turn red, but it'll leave one little shade of light, and then it'll begin waxing again. So, and then one another partial eclipse will occur this year on December 31st. It'll last about an hour, not that long. Then, in 2010, June 26th, another partial eclipse, lasting 2 hours and 42 minutes. And then, two, December 21st, 2010, will be our next total lunar eclipse. That's where the moon will turn red. That one, this eclipse will last 3 hours and 28 minutes, but the length of totality... Uh, where it's completely totaled out, will last longer than the one last year. So, there's your eclipse news.